What's going on, Average Tech Guy here. Today we are back. More tech, more reviews, and I got three cases here from the company Armadillo Tech. They're from the Caseborn lineup, and these are from the V-Series. So let's talk about them. All right, so we got three cases here, and I guess you can tell which one is gonna be the favorite out of the bunch for me. This is the only company that really has a real live orange case. So I know we said this color is kind of orangey, rust orange, but that's a real orange. Like this is the only company that has a real orange case. So big shout out to Armadillo Tech for coming through on the orange for your boy. All right, so um, we've worked with this case before. This is from the V-Series, the biggest, baddest in their bunch. Most protection out of all of them has a kickstand on the back, locks in place. There's no issue there. We'll put that, we'll try that in just a minute. It comes with a padded back on the inside of here. So without further ado, let's go ahead and break this thing open and get it on the phone and see what it looks like. Now, one thing I like about these cases is they have the extra layer of protection, that front, and then that front is basically gonna drop down in this and it's gonna add a little bit more bulk. These cases come in at about three to four ounces a piece. So just keep that in mind. You're gonna add a little bit more girth, a little bit more weight, but you do get a full kickstand on there for a landscape mode and you got kickstand for a portrait mode as well or semi-portrait mode. Yeah, almost portrait. <laughs> but you do get a nice sturdy kickstand on there and it does lock back in place. Nice protection hard backing, hard rubberized edging, and it just looks good, feels good. It's not slippery or slick, and it actually has rubberized grips on the sides right here. Down bottom, everything matches up. You just go down and pull out your S-Pen with ease, and this slot actually gets better and better every year. It's like way more easier to open than in previous years, so I like that aspect of it. On the front, you do get nice rubberized edges and that raised lip as well as the raised lip around the camera. So when you drop it, there are no scratches, no bruises to that camera or to the front of the screen. So you can drop it on the back and you can drop it on the front. There are no issues with any of that. Camera sits down in that deep recess. Buttons, nice and tactile. You really can't ask for much more. There's no screen protector on this, so just keep that in mind. Um, you do have just open screen, but those raised edges will protect that screen from any falls or anything. As long as you don't fall on a, or drop it on a jagged edge, you're good. So that is the orange variation right there. Favorite out of the bunch. It also comes with a purple. Now, you ladies, some of you guys may like the purple, but I'm a really big fan of the insides as well because the inside is just completely orange as well. And that is a padded material. So when you put your phone in there, it's not gonna get scratched up behind all this protectiveness that we got. You're gonna always open down here at this bottom right hand corner. And like I said, there is no screen in there. The one thing we do need to try out is our wireless charge capability because that is a big thing because you know, why buy these phones if they don't wirelessly charge, right? We've gotten accustomed to it over the past few years, so we like our wireless charge. And we find that sweet spot, and there we go. We got wireless charge. It actually supports a fast wireless charge still, so there's no issue with your wireless charge. You're good to go. Like I said, this is just the purple variation of this case. You still get the same kickstand, just like so. Nice and sturdy and it locks back in place. There's no issue there. Um, same protection right here. I just wanted you guys to see this purple variation. Everything's still nice and easy to open up down bottom, still easy to get to that, and all of our cutouts line up perfectly on this phone. And last but not least, we got everybody's go-to, which is the black variation of this case. You still got your same kickstand. I'm just showing everything off nice, hard backing, hard edges. I mean, you can't really ask for much more. It's a nice looking case on a great looking device. That's what it's gonna look like. Not slippery, not slick, 
and doesn't add a whole lot of weight, but it will be a noticeable difference if you've just been carrying the phone or if you've been carrying like a minimalistic bumper style case. These are, like I said, three to four ounces on this case, but that's pretty much it. No big issues from the company Armadillo Tech. All right, so if you're looking for cases that are nice and protective, Armadillo Tech Case Born Series has you covered. This is the V Series, and I think you'll like them. I really love the fact that they have an actual dedicated orange casing. Um, can't ask for much more. I love the orange, and I love all the rest of them. I probably wouldn't buy a purple one, and I would probably buy a black one, but I would definitely buy an orange one because that's my favorite color out of the bunch. But hopefully this has been able to help someone out. Maybe it clear up some questions for you guys. They all have nice tactile buttons. They offer rear camera protection. They offer screen protection with the front raised lip. They actually um, work with your wireless charge and they support fast wireless charge. Uh, so there are no issues with these cases and I give them a big thumbs up. So until next time, be sure and give me that big thumbs up and please subscribe. Average Tech Guy out. Peace.